Welcome back, attractive and well-educated watchers to a brand new episode of NeanderCon, the most exceptional here on Caveman of Cosmos, the best version of civilization ever made. Last time we left off, we, uh, we were going to space. We were exploring space. And we're just gonna keep on doing that. We're gonna dominate the planet by having the high ground in every single war from henceforth into infinity. Yeah. Putting things in space, we're sure. Yep. So, if you're excited to see what happens today, remember to like, subscribe, do all those other lovely things that help support the channel. Go on down to our link tree link in the description. Find all of those other various different places that we do stuff, support us there. Share this video everywhere you can. And if you're an especially attractive and well-educated watcher, go on down to our Patreon via that link tree link in the description. Pledge even just $1 a month to help support the cause and join the mighty, mighty ranks of Mike the Microphone, our number one patron of all time. And Toll Panzer, our number one watcher of all time. Get your name in the game. That's right, this game. Because as you can see from Mike Topia and Tiro Town, we name our cities after patrons. And we have 109 cities, so we need more patrons. A lot more patrons, if you don't mind. You know, if you want to, if you're an especially, especially attractive and well-educated watcher, you know, you consider putting out more money than just a dollar a month. Maybe like five dollars would be great. But, you know, it's, it, even just a dollar gets your name in the game. Okay. Getting sexy up in here. Alright. So... Wait a second. Nope, we're good. Alright. Let's make that jeweler's store. Let's get back into finishing off this continent. Security centers, all the good stuff. Now that we've gotten the space, <clears throat> things will be good. Very good. Also, if you hear thumping or noise in the background, at this point you should know that's our adorable puppers, who by the time you're actually watching this, are going to be like, we don't know, over half a year old? Pretty exciting, actually. You can go over to our farm channel and see all their development. Very exciting. Ah, yes. Yes. Another interplanetary probe. Mercury. Venus. The Sun. Let's just go to Mercury first. The, the Rocky Boys, as you do. Yeah, soon we will have all of the local planets as well. And we shall colonize them. Ooh, yes, good, good. Get that wind farm going. Continue the infrastructural expansion of the Earthlands. Get sexy going. Everybody get sexy. Social justice organization. Wow, Heliopolis, you're that far behind? Jeez. Sponge. Let's get that building complete this turn. Uh, we can get... Sexy that JPL. Very nice. So even as we naturally grow and complete things elsewhere, here on the southern continent, all of the cities join together in a perfected coalition. One that maintains the good supply and well-being and infrastructure of the continent itself. The other continents also work at this, but they're much, much bigger. Uh, no. We don't owe you anything, Selassie. Who do you think you are? You're a vassal state to Catherine. Like, yeah, nah. Nah, that ain't gonna fly here, dog. 
You're lucky that we don't tell Catherine to put you over her knee and paddle your backside is what is what you're lucky for, Holly. We're going to call you Holly whether you like it or not, because that's your name. Holly Selassie. We're actually not sure if that was his birth name. Doesn't really matter at this point. That maglev station going. Oh boy, oh, exploring Mercury. Ooh, look at that. We do not have anything special, so we will analyze the data. Don't know what that does. Oh, it literally just gives us 10,000 gold. Well, that was completely useless. Alright, fair enough. Guess we should have saved that or something. Alright. Sketchtopia grows! Let's get that science symposium. We're entering this new age of great science. Let's get that wind farm going. What we think is funny is that our society at this point absolutely does not need any of this extra energy. But every time we have the opportunity to build some clean power, we do. So we've got wind farms and nuclear power plants and, you know, just all sorts of crazy stuff that makes tons and tons of power. Alright, get some sponges. You know, what can we do? Well, you know, what can we really do? Yeah, we went to Galatarian once, it didn't end up well. We can go to Digital Currency. Uh, oh, inflation goes down. Good. Uh, we have, in short, a ways to go yet. So, for now, we shall instead explore space as one does. And tomorrow, we will beat people up in River City Girls. Tomorrow to you. After we record this episode to us. Yes. Uh, always compensate the families. Oh yeah, I got that commercial airport going. Got a compost dump. Got a financial risk monitor. You know, we should be worried about our money, but at this point, it is as such that we aren't worried about our money because even though we're hemorrhaging so much, you know, 144,000 every turn, we're still going up because reasons, we guess. We don't know. Because inflation. Uh. Oh. Yes. Wonders of the Deep. Because our network of sea mills has failed us. Yeah. We keep getting more rich even as we hemorrhage. We don't know how that works. But. We're not afraid of it. Yeah, we think there has to be a drastic restructuring at some point. Something's got to give eventually. 
So it was 641. Now it's 644. So yeah, even though we're hemorrhaging over 100,000 gold every turn from our basic economy, something's keeping us up. We don't know what it is, but we're more than willing to take advantage of it and just keep rolling on as we're doing. Uh, get that smart grid out. Getting sexy in the game is pretty much one of the most important things right now. So, we will be spending a lot of money and uh, stuff on it. Let's get that astronomical database in Windabona. It's one of the biggest cities on the continent. Subdue the whale shark. Nice. What do we actually have going on? Mm, we have commercials. Lunar base. Ooh, construction ship! Okay. We know what we need to do. <laughs> we know what must be done. We gotta, we gotta make a lunar base. Gotta make that lunar base. We know what we must do. Make a lunar base. Make construction ships. Alright. Let's make that astronomical database in Windabona. Let's just not do anything with that. Alright. We did that wrong. One moment. Because sexy is the most important right now. Alright. And bam. We are under 100,000 in deficit, which is excellent. Oh. Uh, Let's just get Lang Mario Retreat Center or something. One million people in Vigilant Watch. Beautiful. There's something like 30 million people in the entire world, as we recall. It's Or, or maybe like up to 80 million people. Not even 100 million people in the entire world. This world is highly underpopulated. It's no wonder it took him so long to get this far. <clears throat> And we are just under 85% now. The other people are growing, but that's fine. We'll take over 80% still. It's rough times for the economy. Oh, uh, forget it. Forget it. All right. Commercial spaceport, baby. Then sexy has everything. Meanwhile, let's go. Let's go to Uranus. Actually. Let's go to Saturn. You know, the jewel of our... The jewel of our, uh... Come on now. Yeah, jewel of our solar system, Saturn. Okay, it's doing this dumb thing it does. Look at that! Oh, we're gonna go and check that boy out! Oh, Space Station Level 1. Look at that. We are in space. As officially as it gets. Right there. Look at that. Alright. 
Let's get that cafe. Oh, let's get that commercial spaceport. In this case, a more northerly location is important. So, yeah. Sexy, you may be all the way south, but you still get your commercial spaceport. We will not leave you behind because you will not leave us behind. <clears throat> it was a long time ago that we had uh, our problems. Now, smooth sailing. Kablam! Alright. Onward to more space! <clears throat> to all the space! Space! <laughs> Got imaginary physics. Nice. No, we're not giving you anything, Holly. Ooh, dark matter detector. Gravity wave detector. Neutrino observatories. If you've ever actually seen neutrino observatories, they're really cool. Also, if you hear barking in the background, it's because Hudson is dreaming and it's adorable. Lunar bases. Ooh. We do like things that obsolete other things. Yup. Yup. That's what we gonna do. Create asteroid? Oh, man. What are you even talking about here, dude? Ooh! Autonomous vehicles. We're getting up to the actual modern age here. 4D printing studio. Mm. Oh, we can just go straight for it? Alright, let's go straight for asteroid mining. Don't care what anybody says, nobody's gonna stop us. We built the Space Needle. We weren't aware we were building the Space Needle. Uh, the Senate looks good. Still, still chugging along like the Senate always has. But that's fine. Because, after all, it's still the Senate. And it's it was our starting off point. You know, it, it all, on this continent, it all began here. And this is a huge continent. It all began at the Senate. So, uh, yeah. Just get some R&R &R for a second there, boys. Culture Vanuatuan. Alright. Bed and breakfast. That'll bring in some money. Not an appreciable amount, but you know, some. It all stacks up. Maybe. Hopefully. All right, now we're talking. Get that cafe going. Excellent. As you can see, it's really fun and really cool. And we're crushing it. And we're going to space. All that good stuff. Nobody can stop us from our spacely ambitions. Nobody. International port, bad. Spaceport, good. Yes. Ooh, orbital hotels.
We have a clean, beautiful world right now. It's excellent. Wherever we set up, we enrich. And that's what's important. Sexy will need to take a little bit more time, but that's fine. An elephant? Okay. Myth of the Asian elephant. Alright, science symposium. Go. Uh, let's have that. And then another one of those. And then uh, push the limit with that nano research department. And then a space station! Alright. To the jewel of our solar system, please. Alright. The pretty one. You've had a nice turn. Go off and do your thing. Slowly, over time, everything will be great. We have entirely bypassed the era of industrial pollution. And are now entering into the early space age. None. It has become abundantly apparent. That we cannot trust the other nations of the world to work democratically. We, with our great might and numbers, will instead take hold of the world's economy and of the world's priorities. And we shall, with the power of great communications beyond the likes of anything any other nation has ever possessed, Take over space and ensure the Neanderthal supremacy in this universe. Now, watch us thrive. It's good. We like this. We actually like this a lot. It's been really fun so far. Myth B Elephant. What does it actually do? Doesn't really matter. Just gives us some myths. Alright, let's do it. Leroy Jenkins. Uh Donk it donk 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 About here Nothing all right Macau what are you doing Lagging all the way behind forever. Got it. That was probably to be expected. To be fair. Let's just top them off all the same. Boink. Alright. You... Do culture -y things. Get that orbital hotel going. Honestly, we think the best part is just that we've never been this far. 
never experienced what it is to be in the space age of this game. No, we, we can we can get there. There we go. Kablam. Space! Our people are just going to space. All up in that space nonsense. Alright, bloop, bloop, bloop. It'll have it, so it won't matter. And then... Just keep going. Cause space. Hmm. Well, the others are struggling along with fission. We are in space. Exploring the crown jewel of our solar system. Creating greatness previously unforeseen. Boink over there. Oh, yes. Truly, Genghis Khan of the Neanderthal nation has created a great and powerful civilization, the likes of which nobody has ever known. You know, just a thousand years too late. Neutrinos! So now we'll get to see neutrinos. Which, if you've never seen a Neutrino Observatory, they're really, really cool. <laughs> like, really cool. Oh my gracious! Explore Saturn! Cassini Huygens. Oh yeah, it's all coming together now. The age of space exploration is upon us. The time when we live on the moon, it's soon. Very soon. Maybe longer than we'd like, but soon enough. Nobody cares, Catherine. Make your own franchises. Dark matter detector. Ka blam. All that taken care of, so that Sexy can get in on the game. Bam. Then let's just expand that a bit, so we can actually make it. Make that Marine Research Center. Yes. We do not need all of these reclamation plants. You need to get better. Excellent. Those reclamation plants do cost a lot of money to run.
but they maintain an extremely clean world. And for that, we are thankful. So if you liked what you saw today here, remember to like, subscribe, do all those other lovely things that help support the channel. Go on down to our link tree link in the description. Find all the other various different places that we do stuff. Support us there. Share this video anywhere you can. And if you're an especially attractive and well-educated watcher, let's be real. If you lasted this long, you almost certainly are. Go on down to our uh, Patreon VR link tree link in the description. Find all the other... Or, sorry, pledge even just $1 a month to help support the cause and join the Mighty Mighty ranks of Mike the Microphone, our number one patron of all time, and Toll Panzer, our number one watcher of all time, and get your name in the game. Thanks a bunch, everybody, for coming. Stay safe, stay inside, stay healthy, and, of course, remember to help each other. Bye!